Ha ha! Hello, my hearties. A very good morning to you. And dinky do, it's just me, Scotty McClue, popping up on TikTok just for you to say a very good morning to you. And hi. It's Monday morning. It's just gone 17 minutes past 11 in the morning. And a very warm welcome. We did a pop up last night. And boy, was it well received. So I thought I'll pop up again just to see how everybody's doing, and you can let everybody know that we are here. Come and comment, of course, because we want to hear from you. It's all about you. I know you've spent so much of your lives with people saying, oh, it's not all about you, you know. This is all about you. This is fantastic stuff. Hiya, mate. Hiya, Christian. How are you this morning? And a very, very warm welcome. Fantastic. Good morning, Mr. McClusa. Good morning, RST. How lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome. This is absolutely brilliant. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 that you're watching Scotty McClure live on TikTok just for you. Um, I'm good. Absolutely, Christian. That is excellent. Very good to hear. And uh, get following as soon as you come on, guys. As soon as you join us, you should be following Scotty McClure because this is very, very, very big indeed. Uh, tremendous stuff. Now then, there's Pollen's joined us. Alec has joined us. Hello, mate. Are you from Belfast? I'm not from Belfast, but it's lovely to hear from you from Belfast. I say to you, my friend Seth loves Minecraft. So there we are. Ah, I think you do. Wilf, I think you might be a troll. So what we'll do with you, Wilf, is send you down the swanee for being a half-witted idiot. What about that? Shall we say bye-bye to Wilf, everybody? I think we should. He's bad news. That's what I've always said. Let's see if we can get him on here. And we'll say goodbye to Wilf. There we are. Right. That's Wilf. Yes, indeed, and that should come up, and we can chase him down the swanee. There we are. No, I'm not. I'm not, says Wilf. Wilf says he's not a troll. Oh, well. Well, we'll leave you just now, Wilf. Dara says bye, Wilf, but we'll leave him just now, Dara, because he may well learn his lesson, you know, and he might even grow up to have quality chat. Love your content, says Wilf. Okay, Wilf. Well, no silliness now. That's it, and you can stay. So there we are. Chloe, we're going to keep him uh, just for now and see if he learns to talk like a grown-up. That's what we want. Fantastic stuff. Can you give a shout-out to my good friend, Tommy? It's his birthday today. Our boxel. Of course I can. Fantastic. Guys, if you're watching right now, get following as soon as you possibly can. Very, very important. Everybody on Facebook, and also on uh, YouTube, and also on LinkedIn, and also on um, Twitch. Yes, Scotty underscore McClue. Fantastic. And the YouTube channel, everybody should be on that as well. But above, get following on the TikTok. We want to be a, a million, a million followers. So be a big million. Fantastic. That's what it's all about. Kareem's joined us. Good morning. Dinky do, Kareem. Uh, could you please say happy birthday to Emily? It's my cousin's birthday. Chloe, of course I could. Hello. Are you from Cardiff? No, I'm not from Cardiff. Sorry about that. But there you are. But no, I'm not from Cardiff. Scotty, hello. How are we? I'm Dog Pooley. Oh, Dog Pooley going to the vets. Back legs are going, okay, Kareem, strength to you, I say, and strength to the wee dog. But remember, that wee dog could never have had a better life, Kareem. You're the man. Thanks, says our box all. Follow us, guys. Thank you. Estima. Uh, there we are, dinky-doo. Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, Jean. What a thoroughly decent human being. Following Scotty McClure, big style. That's what it's all about. Everybody gets sharing. Kareem's sending me beautiful gifts. He always does. He is such a kind, generous man, as all you TikTokers are. So there we are. Tell us a joke, Mr. McClure. Our boxer. I don't know any jokes. I went into the doctor's. I said, can you help me out? He said, which way did you come in? Ah, there we are. I limped into the doctor's and he said to me, gout. 
and said, I've just come in. It's hard to move to Scotland, my good sir. Oh, very hard to move to Scotland. A very desirable part of the world. There we are. Uh, TikTok, what's that, says Johnny. Ah, Johnny, very good TikTok. Johnny doesn't understand TikTok, and he's on it. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Hey, says a guy calling himself Glasgow Rangers Royal Blue. So there we are. Is that what you call a left footer? Uh, would you rather have toes for fingers or fingers for toes? I'd rather have both for both. I think that's fantastic. But you can paint with your toes, as a wonderful person once did. Uh, thank you. I've had a fire pit, a star, a high July, and a wishing bottle from Karim. Is that not beautiful? Somebody's just sent me something huge as well. Fantastic. Thank you, Big Scotty. How's it going, big man? Daniel, dinky-doo, and a very warm welcome to our morning pop-up. We thought we'd pop up and say hi. Uh, wonderful. Uh, shout out to everybody. Yes, indeed. Uh, do you need to rehydrate? You talk lots, my good sir. If we need to rehydrate, we have got a cup of the tea. Oh, that's great for rehydrating. And we also have a glass of fine Scottish water. Adam's Ale. Kunsel Juice Aqua. Oh, that's absolutely delish. That's me rehydrated, my good sir. Thank you, Team Alk. Uh, Christian has just sent me a solar system. Christian, you've become a top viewer. Is that the great big thing we just saw? Blast its way across the screen. We used to listen to you many years ago on Red Rose. SM, can I tell you, 30 years last Monday, I did my first show on Red Rose Radio. The start of the Scotty McClue phone-ins. Isn't that fantastic? Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, Titan. That's great big man. Absolutely. Is that scotch? No tea mark. Scotch is whiskey, which is alcohol, and I don't drink alcohol. So, so there you have it. Christian has sent me a gift. A beautiful gift. Absolutely. So there we have it. Where's the whiskey gone? Well, we just don't have it in the house. Uh, so nobody comes anymore. <laughs> When's the summer starting, Scotty? I know it's still a little bit wintry out there at the moment, but that will all change. There we are. I seem to be freezing a little bit there, and I shouldn't be. Did the radio job pay well? Well, you see, it paid well in terms of talking to beautiful people. That's what it's all about. You know, I mean, obviously, you can uh, manage to stagger through. Uh, Scotty, are you a Rangers FC fan? Um, well, I'm a fan of lots and lots of football teams. So there we have it. Uh, a bucket hat's just come through. Scotty, I like you. Have a great day, team out. I like you too. You have a great day, my dear fellow. Lovely seeing you there. Where do we get the pies? Says Handy Gal. There we are, yes, Handy Gal, the Scotty McClues pies, of which the top of the range was the original McClues pie and the vegetarian lattice slice and a rich chicken sauce. We like that one as well. Dinky do, Scotty McClue. Campbell, lovely to have you with us. I'm on the way to put the tea on. About time too. The book of time. Now, guys, get sharing. Get watching all the TikTok videos. Get following. We are eventually after one million followers. So get following as soon as you can. And be one of the chosen ones. That's what I say. Be a chosen one. Tremendous stuff. Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, FaZe. And thank you, Like Halo. Tremendous. Like Halo's just followed. What a thoroughly decent human being. What a lovely thing to do to follow Scotty McClue live on TikTok just for you. Uh, that's what it's all about, I say. Alan McLean's joined us. Good morning, Alan. Lovely to have you with us. And uh, thank you for following everybody. So good to have you all with us. Um, I feel I've abandoned you in some of the earlier pop-ups, but we did a wonderful one last night. H8 has just given me a beautiful gift, an ice cream cone. 
I thank you, H8, for your kindness and your thoughtfulness. Can everybody share? And can everybody tap, 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 as soon as you can. Uh, I'm one in a million, uh, so there you are. Yes, the book of time. You talk sense and speak well, says Faze. Faze, I thoroughly appreciate your input. It is very kind of you to notice. There we are. You used to be hilarious on the radio, but I felt sorry for some callers when you were rude to them. Handy, yeah. I have never, ever, ever been rude to a caller. Unless they were rude to me first, of course. Uh, so they are. So no, no, you don't need to feel sorry for these people. These people came on to get themselves an education on the cheap. Yes, indeed, and ended up, boy, did they end up getting an education. So no, no, you never, never need to feel sorry for them. Wonderful stuff. Joe Dinky Doo, good morning, Maggie. Lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome. We'll have to dash off in a few minutes' time, but it's so lovely to be with you. Not rude education, no. Never rude when you're giving people a good education in the book of time. And they got it. Yes, they got it, Handy Girl. Boy, did they get it. That's what it's about. Scotty, I'm under, uh, I'm an under basket weaver. I'm under pressure. Johnny Mickey, what a wonderful, wonderful quality craft and trade to have. There we are, under baskets. So you do you do the bottom or are you under the master weaver? I am asking because I'm very, very interested in that, you know, in case we all have to take up basket weaving if the cost of living gets any worse under the present mob. I say to you, now do come and join us as soon as you can. How's the weather in lovely Scotland? It's a little bit grey today in lovely Scotland. We need some more sunshine, I always say, a bit more sunshine. Now, um, Titan's there, joined us, sending us likes. I've got over a thousand likes, guys, and we've just popped up. Is that not incredible? Scotty for MP says, big up the mandems. Now, um, I'm just thinking, would you like to see me as your member for Parliament? It's always interesting to find out how people see the next step. There we are. I'm learning day by day. That's why I'm tuned to you. Ah, the book of time. And I'm also learning from you. That's why I'm tuned to you. You will see. Tremendous. That's what it's all about. Get sharing. Scott is the future for Scotland. Do you think so? Do you think when it all settles down and we become independent under the crown, Scotty McClure should be the next first minister? Well, that would be a turn up for the books, wouldn't it? Just, I say to you, Scotty, will an independent Scotland have a space programme? Well, I don't know. I mean, I think we need to rebuild the economy first. Once I mm -hmm. see the likes of Greenock and Paisley and Kilmarnock and Stirling and Dalkeith and Muckles and Stenhaven and Inverschnegi, and uh, once I see all these places on Broadford, on Sky, and um, where else, Portree, and Isla, and Jura, and Tarbert, and Ardreshig, and Campbelltown, and Caradale, once I see all these places booming with a real fabulous economy, and Oban, and Tubermory, that sort of thing. Then we might look at a space programme. Scotty for PM, a true Scotsman. Scotty running for president, the president of Scotland. There's a title for you, I tell you. Uh, wonderful stuff. Belfast Jack's just joined us. Good morning, Jack. Lovely to have you with us. A warm welcome to Scotty McClue, hashtag Floatai, the first lord of the internet. Guys, have you followed me? Very, very important to follow me. All right, we can always pop up later. Uh, there we have it. And we might even do a phone in. We might include all the YouTubers. Has everybody watching subscribed on the YouTube channel? That would be a good move to spend your time. An excellent use of your time. The Scotty McClue YouTube channel. It's just simply Scotty McClue 
voice of the world, internet, radio, phone in. You know, uh, will an independent Scotland make kilt wearing mandatory? Ha ha. Well, no, there should be a lot more kilt wearing. It's a very healthy garment and it lets you get a bit of air around the bits and pieces. Are you a gardener, Scotty? As in a heavy oil engine? Or as in, do I have green fingers? That's what we need to know. I, I have a garden, and I do little bits and pieces. You'll see it on the TikTok videos. We always like to have that on the TikTok videos. Tremendous stuff. Green fingers. Ah, green fingers, Jerry. Yes, they're not as green as I would like them to be. They could do with a bit more practice, I say to you. That's uh, that's the thing. How wonderful is that? Uh, tell 10 to tell 10, guys. We're at 1,300 likes. That's all you beautiful people that have gone tap, 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 tap on your phones as we speak. Can everybody get sharing? Is it time? It's time, Jadwick. Yes. Yes, I mean, I think it's time to do the green fingers. Funnily enough, my dear father, who was absolutely multi-talented uh, and a wonderful man, and he was a soldier, a sailor, an airman, a musician, an engineer. He had his own business. He was a great craftsman, a joiner as well. A beautiful carpentry and anything at all. And he was an outstanding gardener. Absolutely. Good morning to you, good sir. Charlie, how lovely to have you with us and thank you do. McClue, McClue, McClue's on fire. Yes, big up the Mandans. We are on fire this morning. Oh boy, are we not just, I say to you. Younger kids need to get taught trades in school more. I agree with you, Jad Reed. There we are. And uh, dinky do fantastic James, follow us as soon as you can. Charlie, thank you for following a thoroughly decent human being thing to do. Unreal, God bless your dad. He was wonderful, Johnny. Big Archie, he would have been a 100 uh, on the 18th of May. You'll see him on a TikTok video. Guys, don't underestimate these TikTok videos. They're made with love for you. Watch every single one of them. Get a smile at some of them and send them round, you know. Absolutely. They're just basically observational. Uh, Scotty, will you take your boat out to the greatest lochs in Scotland? Oh, big up the mandams. How wonderful is that? What about a boat on Loch Lomond? I can remember when a brewery bought the old Countess of Bradalbin, she'd been the Countess of Kempock. Uh, owned by my dear, dear old friend, Roy Ritchie. Lovely, lovely man and a top, a top ferry master. And he'd bought the Countess of Bradalbin from the Caledonian Steam Packet Company and renamed her the Countess of Kempock. And when Roy disposed of the Countess of Bradalbin, she went to Loch Lomond as the Countess Fiona. And they were looking for a skipper for her, and I rang up, but I couldn't get the license required in time, the Board of Trade license, but I knew the boat so well. Scotty, fantastic stuff. Dinky, do. Uh, who have we got? Mark Two's just joined us. Lovely to have you with us, Mark Two. What an absolute privilege and a pleasure to have you beautiful people with us this morning. Just incredible. Um, do tell, do tell what you're up to. I want to know how are things in America? Independence Day. A very, very happy Independence Day to our wonderful American audience this morning. Because, guys, Scotty McClue is huge, huge in America. Two billion people. Greetings from Belfast. Love the Scots. Belfast, Jack. How lovely to have you with us. I went into a pub in Belfast and I said to the barmaid, do you serve shorts? She said, we serve all the big companies round here. Did you see what I just did there? How good is that? Welcome, welcome, welcome. There's Kieran joined us. Wifey's joined us. Wifey for lifey. Uh, Dawood and Nino and Frantastic. Frantastic. 
Welcome, welcome, welcome. I say to Scotty McClue live on TikTok just for you, Dinky Doo. This is just a random live pop up to uh, chill out with the world. That's what it's all about. We'll be popping up later as well. So do not panic if you think I have missed a moment of Scotty McClue. And you never ever miss a moment of Scotty McClure, you miss a moment of life. And that's not good for you. I miss you on Nation Radio, Jen. I miss you guys on Nation Radio. But we're on good terms with the big bosses. And who knows, someday it may well come back. I say to you, that was the last radio station I was on. And we've been 30 years of Scotty McClure last week. Isn't it beautiful? Two billion people throughout the world have heard of Scotty McClure. And I've made about two hundred million pounds for uh, for media moguls. Not for me, but for the media moguls. Uh, what did one duck say to the other duck flying over Belfast? Go quacker! Do you know, Johnny? I can't believe you've told that because if you go on and scroll down the TikTok videos, two ducks were walking down the street in Belfast. And one said, quack. He said, I can't go any quacker. <laughs> we love it. Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, 70s Malcolm. How very nice to have you with us and a very warm welcome. Quality chat, I say. Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, 70s Malcolm, for your very kind follow. A thoroughly decent thing to do. A thoroughly decent human being. Every single member of the human race should set up a TikTok account and follow Scotty McClue. Wouldn't do them any harm. I shall tell you that. Ha ha, says Johnny. Fantastic. That's what it's all about, I say to you. Now, who else have we got here? Follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, Belfast Jack. Very much appreciated for the follow. We want to get to about one million followers. Then we are cooking by gas. So with a long, long way to go. Millions have watched my lives over the last few years. Uh, but only a handful of people are actually smart enough to follow. And that's what we need. We need everybody following. So if you're watching right now, there's Mr. Goldface. And you haven't followed, please do. My mate goes fishing and uses licorice as beat no sm you're working me from the back i've never heard of that are all the fishermen watching can you tell me that there we are he catches all sorts i see i see what you just did there you champ that is absolutely wonderful we like that hello hello new night how are you uh b cup juggly hello Fantastic. Hello, Nuta. Nuta, hello to you. I've been trolling Scotty for two years, crispy bait. You've never trolled me in your life, or you'd have been doing the swanee. Official Prospero has just sent me half a dozen beautiful red roses. Official Prospero, I thank you so much. There we are, dinky do. Missed your live videos. Be cup juggly. So lovely to have you with us. We've missed having you on. And I think it's very important that everybody, at some point in their lives, experiences a Scotty McClue live. I feel sorry for people who go around going, sorry, I, 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 I don't know you. And that kind of nonsense. I mean, how can you not know Scotty McClue? Do you know what I mean? It's just a nonsense. It makes a nonsense of the world. Fantastic. And 30 years, 30 years of Scotty McClue last week. There you are. Can't say fairer than that unless I can't pronounce my F's or T-H's. Uh, always try to get on to watch you. Thank you, Be Cup Juggler. It's appreciated. Now, there we are. Thank you for following Ice. There we are. Good old Ice. Very much appreciated. And dinky do. Uh, here we got Independence, yes or no? Says too cool to dance fast. Um, oh, independence, definitely. But economic independence under the crown. Every single Scottish person needs to be 100% pro-royalist 
Otherwise, independence will be toast. Kicked into the long grass like Scottish Labour was at Indie Ref 1, or just Indie Ref, as they say, and we don't want that again. So there you have it. If I'd been running Scottish Labour at the time of Indie Ref 1, I would have phoned Westminster and said, sorry guys, we're going to have to cut you loose. We're going with independence. And that would have been that. Where can I get a badge? Like on the top of your cap. I have them here. But I cannot do merchandise until we reach one million followers. So get following, guys. And we've got some way to go. Then come the merchandise. The badges. Uh, I'll be laughing. Uh, Scotty McClue's summer bathing suit calendar. Oh, wow. Will you be laughing? Launching, I think you mean. They're also the biggest benefit to each of the country. You see, you're 100% wrong there, Brian Harper. 100% wrong. They bring in 10 times what they cost us. More than 20 times what they cost us. The Queen gives us 75% of her income straight to the Treasury. So there's no benefit cheats. There's no taking. They are worth a fortune to this country. They are our biggest asset. So whatever rubbish you've had your head stuffed with, Brian, it's wrong. Okay, you got that, la la? Ah, Scotty, I need one. Aren't they beautiful? The Scotty McClear badges. One million followers. Get following. Root to point. Get following. Get following. As soon as you possibly can. Everybody should follow. Here, here's the SSM. It doesn't matter, empty castles in France bring in more than a royal No, they don't, Brian. And this is not uh, France, you've had your head stuffed with that nonsense as well. Could you imagine what Versailles would bring in if Le Roi de Soleil was still living there, the Sun King? Dinky do, royals are a waste of money. We're not wasting money. Royals bring in money. Hello, hello, silly, silly, daft person. Clean out your ears. And uh, so I deserve one. You do be cup juggling. I have a question for you, says Liam. Liam, you press on, my dear fellow. Have you ever tried, says Liam, wait till we see. No, Liam, you mustn't assume everybody has your lifestyle. There we are. Are you in Yorkshire? No. Sadly, I'm not in Yorkshire this morning. I'm in a beautiful part of the world called Scotland. But boy, do I love Yorkshire. I think I'm probably the only honorary Yorkshireman. One of me. There we are. So there we have it. So, Leon, you mustn't assume. Uh, so there we are. Did you ever get to bow before Prince Andrew? No, I've never met him, but I did get to bow before his brother, Prince Charles. So there we have it. Scotty, are those pictures of you behind you? Of course they are. There we are. That one is Red Rose Radio. Presentation portrait. Isn't that beautiful? Uh, Red Rose Gold. And that one, I move out the road. I move. That's uh, graduation with Lord Reith the Labrador. Lord Reith was graduating and I went along to hold the hood. Uh, uh, sorry to tell you, royals bring division. They never bring any division in the Book of Time. Why on earth would they? It's a very simple system. Don't get hung up with the personalities. Her Majesty the Queen, outstanding public servant, cannot be faulted, and uh, she's the curator and custodian of the crown. That's our symbol of authority. End of. Sorted. No other argument about royalty. Ah, uh, Fair play, lovely pictures. Thank you, Johnny. There we go. Fantastic stuff. Now, uh, who else have we got on here? Uh, we've got uh, Sean. Thank you, do, Sean. Lovely to have you with us. Shall we say bye-bye to Liam, guys? Because he's an idiot. Yes, no place on here for the Liams of this life. We give him a lifetime ban. Here he's gone. Lovely. Fantastic. Yes, hello, life. Scotty, I have to go. Thanks for the last shout-outs and no free badge. Aha! There's no such thing as a free badge. One million followers. Then it's badge time. 
Uh, wonderful. Have a lovely day, B Cup Juggler. So lovely to have you with us. And thank you for the follow and dinky do, I see. If you've just joined us every day, a very, very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue. We're live on TikTok just for you. We are looking for one million followers. We're a little bit away. But if you're watching and you haven't followed, please do. You, I think you go up to the top left-hand corner and click plus. Is that right? Does anybody know? Send them down the Swanee from Tomo. Yes, indeed. Thank you, Mr. Food. Uh, Dinky do, Scotty McClue. It's called a cult by Scottish people in my family for years. A cult, a kilt. It's, it's actually a kilt. It's K-I-L-T. Follow us as soon as you can, guys. Thank you, dude. Thank you very much. If you haven't followed, get following first off. That's what it's about. You're a wannabe Englishman with your affected accent. Scotland the Brave. No slave. No user 375. This is a pure 100% Scottish accent. Perhaps you have an English accent. You are affected. And you might be infected. We don't know. So there you are. Uh, you'll be a slave if you don't get sorted out and get independence under the crown. There we are. Dinky do. Keep following, guys. As soon as you possibly can. Very important. There's the wonderful Paul Douglas. Dinky do, Paul. Fantastic. I say to you. Bobby Mustang uh, has got a so There's no wannabe anything user 375. You mustn't judge others by your own standards. That's what I say. There we are. Have it. Dinky do. I don't even have an accent. This is the way I speak and have been since birth. <laughs> you can't beat that, can you? Bernino, lovely to have you with us. Do you think the referendum will ever happen, Scotty? I don't see any reason why not. Because it's all very well for Westminster to be difficult. Because, I mean, they're absolutely scared witless that Scotland leaves. Because the money goes, you see. And they are stealing Scotland's money. Do you support the Orange Order in Scotland? Well, Kevin, I was just wondering. I mean, the Orange Order is about the Crown and the Bible. Uh, the Catholic Church are into the Crown and the Bible. So why not a Catholic set up as well for the Orange Lodge? You see what I mean? A Catholic Orange Lodge or a Green Lodge. Uh, I'm just wondering why we're still marching for a battle that happened, what did we say, 332 years ago? Seems a bit strange, doesn't it? 330, yeah, 300, 332 years since that battle. I mean, I don't march for Sochibun or for Flodden or for Sheriff Muir or for the Somme even, for Magersfontein, for Vimy Ridge. You know, and uh, I did uh, a little TikTok video to this effect the other day. Have you ever had a dog in Scotland? Uh, yes, two dogs. The Orange Disorder. Yes, yes, because they can be a bit wild. The Silly Billies. Yes, indeed, they can be a bit wild, can't they? I tell you, it's quite interesting, the Crown and the Bible. But no, I would imagine in the interests of equality, uh, the Orange Lodge should have a look at uh, bringing in our Catholic brothers and sisters to the Orange Lodge. Uh, both are Catholics and should support each other. Yes. Well, you see, any Christian is Catholic, just not necessarily Roman Catholic. You see, they're not run from Rome. Scotty is the man, John T. Bond. How lovely to have you with us and a very big dinky do. Welcome to Scotty McClure, hashtag Flutai, the first lord of the internet, the world's top broadcaster and the voice of the world and the world's most humble man and the father of feminism. Actually, I don't really claim to be the father of feminism because feminism is a con. The woman, the woman, the women. The women are being conned. The government brought in feminism and managed to sell it to the women so that they got two uh, lots of income coming in. You got that right? I get it all right, book of time. Josh Dinky Doo. Hello, Scotty. Hello, Josh. I lovely to have you with us. And Dinky Doo, I was wondering how you are getting on and are you collecting the new coins for the Jubilee? Uh, you're not on the radio anymore. I haven't been on the radio for about 
18 months or two years, we socks, something like that. The last one I was on was Nation Radio Scotland. Fantastic, but it was getting a bit much for them, having three big phone-ins a weekend when the staff were trying to get a bit of downtime, you know. But that's the gig I always say to people. That's what it's all about. If you can't stand the heat, don't go into the kitchen. And so there you are. You were some laugh or oh, we socks. Were we not just? It wasn't just me that was some laugh. The people of Scotland, the people of Yorkshire, the people of the northwest of England, the people of the Midlands, the people of London, they were some laugh. The people of Teesside, the people of Newcastle. Uh, Scotty, how come I've not seen you live in a while? Well, Kian, maybe you're not getting the notifications. Kian, are you also on uh, Scotty McClure's YouTube channel? That's a big one, I would urge you to take a wee look at that. Of course, that's important as well. And dinky do. Guys, can everybody follow me if you're on? If we get one million followers, which we should get in the next few days, then uh, we can start bringing out the merchandise for you. Dinky do from Scotty Macklew. <laughs> Wonderful stuff, I say. Slowed down the coin collecting. I'm more into railway photography now. If I do get new releases, I had Josh Brilliant, top man. Uh, yes, and you got the Flying Scotsman, didn't you? How amazing is that? Where do you broadcast? I broadcast on TikTok. I started broadcasting on Twitch at Scotty underscore McClue. I uh, have Twitter at Scotty McClue. I have TikTok, obviously, at Scotty McClue. I have uh, Facebook Live, Scotty McClue. We've actually got five pages. We've got a website, scotty-mcclue.com, which 10, 10, 11 million people have visited it. I'm, I'm off. Love to hear you, but may not agree. That's what people do. Book of time. That doesn't matter. The fact is we're talking. It's a conversation. Jackie Fee Fife, David Fee Scotland, you've all joined us. Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. Lots to talk about, so little time to do it in. I'm going to have a sip of tea. Can we have a follow fest? If you haven't followed, let's have a follow amnesty. Everybody follows right now. Ah, do you have a fax machine? I do have a fax machine, although I don't think it's plugged in. I don't get many faxes these days, uh, to be quite honest. With you. There's Ronnie from Port Glasgow. Ronnie, how lovely to have you with us from Port Glasgow. Did you see my TikTok video on Port Glasgow? Hello, it's just me, Scotty McClure. I'm live from a wee place in the west of Scotland called Port Glasgow, the Port of Glasgow. I might go down and do some Scottish towns for you. Uh, share the lives of any very important followers as soon as you possibly can, guys. This is very, very important. There we are. We need lots and lots of followers. And if we get one million, then we are laughing. Uh, user424 says no, but I don't know what he says no to. There we are, because it's so long since we saw him do... The other bit, uh, there we have it. Oh, yes, we've got use for to fill. You haven't seen it, right. You need to go on and see if you can see that on TikTok. Absolutely got you, Ronnie. There we go, good man, and you will love it. I'm at the Comet beside the supermarket, and the Portonians were so lovely to me. They were offering to hold the phone for me, and, uh, you know, they were offering to be in it. Uh, tremendous stuff. Wonderful. So I ended up doing a bit of talent work uh, in the port. Yes. So get a look for that, Ronnie. You will love it. What were you famous for? I was famous for informing. I still am famous for informing, educating and entertaining the world. So that's not a lot to ask, is it? The people that I educated, the people that I informed, and the people that I entertained, second to none, two billion people worldwide. Isn't that amazing? That's famous. But I don't call myself famous. I just tell people I'm well known. 
And that's kind of enough, really, to be honest with you. Thank you. Thanks, Ronnie. You'll get it there. You'll love it. It's on the TikTok videos. And you scroll down and you'll see me there in Port Glasgow with the comet. I couldn't even work the phone, so it's quite funny. And uh, obviously the name Comet is backwards. So there we are. So what would that be? Uh, the Timok. The Timok. Uh, wonderful. Because the present Comet, the one there, are you a comedian? Uh, I was a stand-up comedian for a while, but I was asked to sit down. Uh, yes, indeed. Uh, and I gave up comedy because people were just laughing at me all the time, you know. Yeah, it's too much. It's too much. But uh, you get yourselves on. Scotty McClure is the person for you. Thank you, MIP003. I love your badge. It looks very, very impressive. Guys, as soon as we get a million followers... Merchandise time, Scotty McClure badges. That's what it's all about. There we are, fantastic. Now then, what else have we got? We've got Magic 364's just joined us, Dinky Doo Magic. Lovely to have you with us. Get following, guys, if you haven't followed. For instance, have you followed MIP? It's all very well, Archie Bargy with Scotty McClure, but you need to follow. Yeah, we want a million followers. It's not a lot to ask nowadays. And there's no reason why people shouldn't. Uh, so there we have it. 30 years of Scotty McClure the world has had. And there we are. There's Mr. Fuchs. It's F-U-C-H-S, Fuchs. Yes, I think that's the name. Followers, guys, as soon as you are, what price are the wee badges? Well, you know, Johnny Mickey... We talked about this because I like people to get things for a fair price, a screaming bargain, value for money, like our royal family are. You know, it's that sort of thing. And we thought the badges, some people were saying five pounds. I mean, two of them went for 400, so 600 quid each at a charity auction once. Uh, so there were, but we thought, we thought maybe... A fiver wouldn't be too much as a kind of donation. Scotty McClure's always been free at the point of reception. So you get Scotty McClure 100% free. There we are. Good morning, Scotty. I hope all's well from Nova Scotia. Devil, we love you in Nova Scotia. I hashtag Nova Scotia in one of the last broadcasts because I thought you'd like it. Highland Games next weekend. Devo, I should have shown you the picture of Scotty McClure as the chieftain at the Highland Games. Yes, indeed. Fantastic. Did I, Ewan? Tremendous stuff. Good to have you with us. And uh, there's Robert and there's Wintercat Dinky Doo. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome, guys. Do you know what I've just seen? It's just coming up to 12 midday. Isn't that fantastic? Lunch with Scotty McClure. In fact, it is 12 midday right now in the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. And uh, what time is it in the United States? Hey, hey, your ban. Hoban, how lovely to have you with us. Hoban or Yoban? How do you like to be addressed? Dinky Doo from the Madhouse. 8 a.m. here in Canada, says Devil. Isn't that beautiful? Eight o'clock in the morning in Canada. We love it. You're four hours. I love your accent, says Hoban. Hoban, it's not really an accent. It's just the way I speak, uh, you know, and, and always have spoken like this. You can look up stuff on Scotty McClure from 30 years ago. Just the same. There we are. That is fantastic. Eight o'clock in Canada. And, of course, was it not Nova Scotia that Marconi sent, uh, I mean, I got a great compliment. Somebody said, Scotty McClure has uh, done the most for radio since Marconi. Happy Independence Day to America. Yes, America. A very happy Independence Day to Uncle Sam. Lovely to have you with us. And did you do, do you think Donald Trump will be back with you in 2024? I suspect he well might. I really do. Fantastic stuff. But there it goes. We shall see. 
Now then, who else have we got with us? How are you? Hope on. I am absolutely outstandingly well. Uh, I think I might have to go soon. God, I hope so, says James. James wants Trump back. The radio was brilliant, user 424. Although I say it myself, the radio was brilliant because the people all joined in and we had fun together. There we are. I mean, huge, huge audiences. Millions, millions joining us, you know. Just call me Joe. Okay, Joe, I will do that. A lovely name, Joe. But there we are. But so is Hoban. We like that as well. What a lovely, lovely name. Hey, hey, Scott, how's you, Ricky? Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome, I say. We'll pop up for just maybe another minute or two, guys. Uh, I'm here in the UK with the US Air Force. James, welcome. We love you being here and thanks be to God and the US Air Force. Yes, what are you flying? Are you flying the typhoons? Uh, you know, do you enjoy motoring? I enjoy motoring. I put on my motoring hat. I don't know if I've still got it. Let me see if I've got my motoring hat uh, for motoring. You say, well, what else would you do with it? Yes, I have. I've got my motoring hat. I think I'll pop it on for a bit of motoring. <laughs> there we are. Now, uh, we've got to get it right. There we are. There's Scotty McClure's motoring hat. How's that, guys? That should be all right. <laughs> And uh, there we are, F-15s and F-35s. Excellent, James. Uh, you know, I uh, I sometimes walk somewhere where you're just over my head when you're landing. I won't be so basis to say, uh, but, you know, fantastic. Don't drive without it. You can't, you shouldn't drive without your motoring hat. You're looking rather dashing. Do you like the motoring hat, guys? We'll have to put a Scotty McClue badge on it. In fact, that's maybe something we can do right now. And your plus fours. Hello from Australia, you legend. Colly Perrett, we love having you from Australia. And I send love to Australia all the time. But in particular today, because I've seen what's been happening in Sydney with the floods. And I send love and stand. And uh, run your politics for you, you know, that sort of stuff. Get you back on track, so to speak, because I know you've had a tough time. Guys, I'll tell you what I think I'll do. We'll put a badge on the motoring hat. Yes, so I'll pop on my ordinary cap just now. And uh, with your permission, I shall, uh, with your permission, I shall pop this on the motoring hat, because I think, that's actually quite important. I think every hat should sport a Scotty McClure badge. It's part of life. If you're looking after Scotty McClure, you're looking after your life. Never miss a second of Scotty McClure. Ah, the floods are bad. They are, Cully. But we send you love, every single one of you diggers from Down Under. Have I got my Down Under hat? Hang on. I'll just say, I've got, I think I've got my jackaroo here. Yes. There we go. How's that for you in Australia? A genuine jackaroo. Uh, there we are. Uh, I regret Brexit. I'm moving to Spain. Everybody regrets Brexit. Even the Brexiteers, but they're too stupid to say. Uh, you know, you are so dashing. Lovely thing to say, Joe. I thank you. There we are. So I've got my down under hat uh, looking after our Australian brothers and sisters and sending love to Sydney and um, strength uh, and God love you to the beautiful people who have been so unfortunately flooded out of their homes. Yes, indeed. Really great, mate. Do you like that one, Coley? Absolutely. All shoes it wouldn't do in a bit of shearing. Uh, so there we are. Now, I'm going to swap it for the motoring hat, though, Coley, with your permission. That would be wonderful. So I take this off, and I pop on the motoring hat, but the motoring hat now sports 
a Scotty McClue badge. Is that not just it and a bit, guys? There we are. Fantastic. Really great, mate. Uh, loves. I'm going to have to dash. It's been a privilege today to be with you, as always. Follow me on TikTok. Get onto the YouTube channel and subscribe. Scotty McClue, voice of the world. I can see the pup from here. John Watson. Dinky do, that's what it's all about, I see. Uh, wonderful. Now, uh, take great care of your dear selves, won't you? I'll sing you the goodbye song. Are you ready? <clears throat> goodbye, everybody, goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Auf Wiedersehen. Au revoir. And a cheerio. I love this man, says Callum. We love you, Callum, and dinky do. Lovely to have you all with us. Take great care of your dear self. Stay fabulous. And as we say in the best of circles, dinky do, stick out your tongues right now and say ta-ta. Ta-ta.